Alrighty, so this is Shovel Knight. This was made by Yacht Club Games, as can be seen below, and this is one of the most requested videos that I do. I've been told that this game will literally change my outlook on gaming. I've also been told that this game will give birth to, like, a baby that will save the universe when Cthulhu attacks. That's another story entirely. Yeah, I have some crazy fucking followers. But, uh, yeah, you're not, not standing. Let's start this fucker. <laughs> I like it. Oh, shit. I'm tempted to... <laughs> yeah, fuck it. Ah, for all time's sake, why not? Something's so wrong with me, I swear. Yeah, sure, why not? Long ago, the lands were untamed and roamed by legendary adventurers. Of all heroes, none shone brighter than Shovel Knight and Shield Knight. their travels together ended in the Tower of Fate when a cursed amulet wrought terrible magic. When Shovel Knight awoke, the tower was sealed, and Shield Knight was gone. Uh-oh. The spirit broken, a grieving Shovel Knight went into a life of solitude. Really? This dude went into solitude, dressed like that. Whoa. But without champions, the land was seized by a vile power, the Enchantress and her Order of No Quarter. Order of No Quarter, that's awesome. Now the tower is unsealed and devastation moves. A new adventure is about to begin. Dot, dot, dot. I actually feel really bad right now. I talked over that music and that music was amazing. Get digging. Good, no fucking tutorial to tell me what the fuck to do. Just beat the shit out of everything. Or not. <laughs> yeah, I thought maybe I'd play this with the damn controller that I have, but honestly, it's kind of stiff. Wow. This really does feel like a Nintendo game. What was this? Ooh. Okay. Motherfucker. Yeah. <laughs> Wait a minute. Nags is for show. Wow, this music is fucking wicked. Get faster, Shovel Knight! Oh, shit. You know, I figured there'd be more to it than that. Uh, save point, I'm guessing. Whoa. Wait, hold on. Oh, you can attack from a thing. Awesome. I was kind of worried about this one, I'm not going to lie, because nostalgia can be kind of a double-edged sword. It can be amazing at times, but people oftentimes forget how damn difficult some of those older games were. Don't get me wrong, they were amazing. Castlevania is one of my all-time favorites, but is it one of the most difficult fucking games out there also? You better believe it. Oh shit. Go oh, fuck! You asshole! I refuse to get my ass kicked by bubbles! 
Aha! Eat it! Whew! Alright, uh, so what are they saying? Alright, oh, nostalgia. Nostalgia's a double edged sword. Oh! That is wicked. I feel like I'm playing DuckTales. I feel like I'm playing like, like a combination of DuckTales and Mega Man. But yeah, back to, back to nostalgia. Um, nostalgia can be a double-edged sword because a lot of times people forget how difficult and unbelievably like annoying some of those older games could be. Don't get me wrong, I love the games like Castlevania and Ninja Gaiden. You know, other ones come to mind as well. Those are two off the top of my head. Oh, Blaster Master, one of my all-time favorites. Blaster Master, however, kicked the shit out of me as a kid. When I say kick the shit out of me, I mean like literally abuse me like a fucking... Like, just, it destroyed me. It had me screaming at the TV when I was just a, just a kid. And it was ridi... Whoa. It was just ridiculous how much, like, annoyance I went through over one video game. But at the same time... In the end, playing through those levels, I must have played through, what was that, third level? Yeah, the third level, wait a minute. Wait, go back, go back. Oh, ho! So yeah, anyway, that third level in Blast Master, I must have played that level a hundred times. And I always would get my ass kicked. And I'd always be exploring for something else that wasn't actually there, because I'm an idiot like that. But I was always looking for secrets and stuff. Yes! I'm, I'm, I'm literally trying to have a conversation while playing this, and this ain't gonna work. <laughs> Wait a minute. IDEA TIME! So yeah, as I was saying, um, nostalgia. So I played through the I played through the level like God knows how many times. I it took me over a year to beat that game. I won't even lie, I was, I was terrible at it at first. In most Nintendo games, you could beat them in a couple hours usually, but back then, holy crap, the challenge factor was off the wall. That journey to Silius, uh, ca again Castlevania, again it's always gonna come back to Castlevania for me. Castlevania was notorious for wrecking my shit up. Meanwhile, Castlevania 2, one of the hardest games I think I ever played in my lifetime. Also remains one of my all-time favorites. Hmm. I see your game here, Shovel Knight. Oh god. This reminds me so much of Mega Man, the fucking music's not helping. I don't want to go that way, though. Oh shit. Oh god. I don't even know how I'm supposed to go this fucking way. <sighs> Fuck! Oops. <sighs> Shit. Wait, recover? Oh, I have to get it back? Shit, I didn't realize I was playing Dark Souls. <laughs> um, so anyway, Blaster Master, Blaster Master, I, beat, I played that third level a million times. And I finally beat that son of a bitch boss, and I just remember this unbelievable feeling of success, but terror over like overcame me at that point in time. Because I'm like, if this took this long to do, how much harder is the next part of the game gonna be? And I'll be honest with you, the next part of the game was never. Oh shit! <sighs> you know, I must thought I was stuck there for a second. Like, no, good games were designed to blast this stuff. Round two! Oh shit. Give me my fucking treasure back! Ugh, damn it, I'm never gonna get that, am I? Ugh. Oh shit, I did it! I fucking did it! It's moments like that, moments just like that, where you overcome the odds despite everything you think about a game. That's nostalgia for me right there. When shit like that happens. 
And I may have just started playing this two minutes ago, but you know, at the same time, it doesn't matter. I'm gonna remember that for the duration of this game. And probably after it, too. Wait a minute. Uh huh. Yeah. I sh oh, shit! I should have seen that coming. Fuck you, dragon! This is one well made game, Jesus. But, um, yeah, so, it all it comes back to is me remembering, like, how hard as balls some of these games were. And just being terrified of them. I love them, but don't get me wrong, they kicked my ass. Wait. Why would he just. I kinda wanna go down that hole. I kinda wanna go down here, but I'm afraid of dying, so. Um... I'm not gonna do that. Yeah, thanks for the boost, asshole. Oh god, not again. You suck! Yeah! Jesus! Shit! Alright, what game was I talking about for? Alright, Castlevania! Yeah, Castlevania did that to me quite a bit. No. Why would I be able to... Wait a minute. No. I almost fucked that up entirely. Oh, you dragon, lucky son of a bitch. I missed a secret there, too. I'm gonna try to get to it. But yeah, fucking Castlevania. Those backdrops of death. It's even got the Mega Man sound when he dies. Or close enough to it. It sounds just like it. Ah ha! Fuck you! How do you like it? I certainly didn't fucking enjoy it. Oh, yeah, Castlevania had this really annoying. Ah shit! Oh god, I'm in Rape City here. Wait a minute. Ah oh, shit. I can get back up there. Damn it, Shovel Knight, your horns are blocking my progress! Wow, I blew it, I can't get back up there. I really can't get back up there. <laughs> Shit. Wow, I didn't think I was gonna make that jump. Castlevania had that though, where the backwards fall of death. I hated that with a passion. It used to screw me up so bad as a kid. That being said, I think other people had more problems with Castlevania than I possibly did at times, because... Whoa. That's what I'm talking about. Castlevania killed me mostly in the enemy difficulty types. Um, Castlevania 3, for example, one of the enemies is so obnoxiously annoying, it just keeps respawning in endlessly. And I'm not talking about the Medusa heads, because that's a famous one that a lot of people like to complain about. No, not even close. Medusa heads never bother me for the most part. It's just a pattern you gotta fucking memorize. Yeah! Oh, fuck. Should I voice act it? Hmm. Yeah, sure. I knew you'd show your face sooner or later. The cruelly and coward. Well, that's pretty harsh, dude. Turn back, Shovel Knight. There's nothing here for you anymore. Nah, I'm not gonna voice act this stuff. This sound retarded. This name is uh, Black Knight. I'm gonna read it out loud to myself because I'm an idiot. Nah, I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna quarrel with you. Just... Order of no quarter. I love that. That's that's just catchy as all hell. St 
steal thy shovel? Really? Oh, shit! Come on, bring it, motherfucker! Clearly somebody didn't- Oh, shit! Oh, God! Oh, he's got a shovel, too! Shut up! Whoa. She's- <laughs> Holy shit! Not fair! Yeah, fuck you! My shovel is clearly the best shovel ever! Oh, come on! Really? Well, yeah, it is a shovel. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I spent most of this video talking about old video games. <laughs> I can't help it, man. I have not been this nostalgically driven to talk about old school stuff in a long time. And, I mean, I'm, I'm pretty well known for a guy who screams and rages at old school games, but I actually have a great love for them. And this was made by people that really knew what the hell they were doing. Perfect sense. That was friggin' surreal. Okay. Okay! <laughs> but it's not a sword, it's a shovel. Is that a lady a horse? Whoa. <laughs> Did you know your fishing rod can hail up faraway bags and gems out of your reach? Hey, it's the truth. Why wouldn't it be the truth? Wow, villagers actually say useful stuff. <laughs> I did find a music sheet. Oh, I found two. Excuse me. Excuse me, pre uh, bard. I kind of want to say no to see what happens. My guy has a fine musical taste. Should have studied composition, but then I suppose I'd be the Oh, wow. That is such a cool fucking song. But you are walking around. Oh, these people are retarded. <laughs> How do I fucking know? Does that always work? Oh shit, it does. Yeah, it's empty now. Classic! What is this? Pottage and poultry, mutton and meat. Maximum health will increase if you eat. We're gonna meal tick and I'll whip up a feast. Goaticians? <laughs> what the fuck? I 
It kind of worries me. Like, hmm, what was I doing? <laughs> cool. Oh, that's fucking wicked. What the friggin... What's this, tavern? Yeah, juice made. <laughs> Hence, there's acolyte wishes goats. Everyone's welcome in here. Goats?! That sounds like a promise. Oh, woe is me, the king of nothing. Not to rule but my lone bar stool. <laughs> King Knight sits on the Pride Morse throne. The Guild the Goon, he'll get his soon. Uh, fucking rhyming shit! What is this, Child of Light again? Double trouble, soil, and shovel. I don't know what you use this in. That's right, it's only been two, and those were mistakes. That won't happen again. I've been playing this for 18 minutes. This is. Amazing! I'm enjoying this way more than games I played hours. Uh, my character talked, dude. That's pretty cool. Uh oh, secret! That fucker. Oh, what the fuck happened to my skills? Let's make up for this insult. <laughs> Holy shit. Why is she fucking? No. God damn it. Oh god, this looks horrible. I apologize to everybody who knows what the fuck they're doing in this game. I clearly do not. Supposed to hit all of these. Oh. Oh, cool. Yeah, I guess it would map out. I just wasn't expecting that. I wasn't expecting any of this. Like, can I talk to this guy yet? I need a relic. Wow, this is still going? What would that fucking prove? Exposition! Bag fellow. This is ridiculous. Oh shit, there's a... Oh damn, how do I get up there? Oh! Who'd have thunk it? Yes! Yes! <laughs> My resolve is fine, thank you very much. Wait, wait, what the fuck was she saying? <laughs> oh my god.
I'm not really sure where the hell I'm supposed to go. What is he talking about? Just want to make sure you don't have to save. Strike the Earth. You got it. Oh man, I'm really reminded of freaking Castlevania. Oh shit. Oh shit! Yeah, you bring that shit on, motherfucker! Wow, that's probably if some of the best, if not the best 8-bit fucking renditions I've heard in a long ass time. Ah! Oh, wait a minute. Oh shit, oh no, ghosts! Fucking ghosts! Oh, I gotta dig up his corpse? What the hell? Ah, fuck! Fucking frog! I'm not- Oh shit! Oh, I bet I could've friggin- Damn it, think like a shovel knight. Wow, he just lost his fucking head. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> I used your own fucking head again. Ah, damn it! Maybe I could trick the game. Come here! Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Come here. Thank you, NES! Thank you, Yacht Club Games, for actually remembering things like that. I thought it was a save point, shit. Guess not. Oh my god, not again! Wait a minute. Oh shit, oh balls. Duck tail it! <laughs> I kind of want to go back to the other area, but I just want to kind of move on now. I'm not looking to get 100% in this game anyway. Oh, you little shit! Look at that! Timing is required. Fuck me. <laughs> oh man, I didn't think I was going to make that. Oof, I didn't think I was going to make that either. Fuck him. Whoa! Not cool! Can't see a damn thing! Okay, these enemies you obviously can't fucking kill. Fuck off! These fucking ghosts are annoying. They don't do much though. I mean, I don't really... What did I say about fucking off? This is where one has to be careful. One misjump, one miscalculation, and I'm fucked. Hmm. 
little fuckers. Ah! This is fucked up that that would be there in the first place. What the hell is the point of this? There's nothing there, though. Wait a minute. Oh, shit! Wait a minute. Wait, do I have to make him go... Oh, shit. I think I know what you gotta do for this part. Wow, is that really what they want me to fucking do? That's kind of timing crazy. Yeah, no, I can't. I can't. I'm not that skilled. <laughs> this looks bad. Oh, shit. <sighs> oh, man. Holy shit on a pita. I thought I was dead. Oh, you fuck. Why? Damn it! I fucking lost everything! Some bullshit! Fucking frog! Wait, wasn't there something I missed here last time because I fucked up? I couldn't get back to it. Ah! Ah, oh, you fucking. Oh, that's right, I already rated that one. EAT IT! No. Ah, oh, shit. Okay, so some of the stuff you change stays the same. Get your ass over here! Really? Ducktails this shit out of ass. It's the easiest way to do it. It's just a ducktail. Just down, down thrust, down thrust, down thrust. Oh yeah, if there's anybody watching who doesn't know what the hell ducktails is that I keep referencing every two minutes, you, you need to play ducktails. That's that's kind of it. Actually, is there anybody who hasn't fucking played ducktails on the NES? I think that's considered required gaming at this point, huh? Jesus H, I'm getting my ass wrecked. Just wanna move on fast! I don't like that the thing appears afterwards there. Yeah, boom, motherfuckers! Steal my shovel. Wait a minute. Uh huh. Oh boy. Oh god. Oh shit. <laughs> that could have ended really badly. <laughs> Gonna end it really, really, really badly. I don't understand the point of that. I don't even know how the hell you get up there. Wait a minute. I can still swing while I'm. 
No, there's nothing there. No, you can't. You can't get on top either. So I don't really get it. Maybe something later. Oh god, not this part again. Fight me like a man! No fucking around here. That didn't work. My fucking go back! Oh shit, there's spikes up there. I just noticed it now. Wow, talk about not paying a fucking attention. I almost died like three seconds ago. And I'm betting that spikes are instant death in this game. If it's old school, then spikes are death. And no, I'm not testing that theory. Die, insect! You don't belong in this world! I hate bugs anyway. All that glitters is not gold. These fucking stages are hard. Like, you could barely see anything. Ha! <laughs> Sucks to be you, asshole. Shit. Wait, that doesn't go in? So what the fuck do I... Huh? Oh, wait, 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 wait. I know how. Wow, really? That's fucking... That's really, really creative. Now, I'm, I'm officially fucking impressed. I will say that right now. Oh, no, wait, no, I didn't fuck myself over yet. Well, I kind of did. I can't get to that one. Damn. Actually, no, I could come back and do it. Oh, wait, no, first. That's not a save point either! Holy shit, where the hell are the fucking save points in this game? Ah! That sucked ass. <laughs> that was all my fault. How the hell do I... Wait a minute. Ah, oh, shit. I think I might have really fucked this one up here. So yeah, the thing about nostalgia was the games were awesome, it's just they were hard as all balls at times, so they had these moments that would just drive you fucking crazy. That being said, it never stopped you from going back. It was always a fair... There was always what they called fair challenge. Nowadays, people forgot about the hell fair challenges. They make games that are incredibly difficult just because. They really, they have no fucking idea what nostalgia is. They just make hard games that think... Oh, well, NES games were fucking hard as nails, so everything else should be hard as nails, too. That's not how it works. Huh. You are a stupid fucking boss, and I fucking hate you. No, no, you're gonna die. 
Let's do this. Get the fuck up and die! Thank you, Jesus. Wait a minute. Oh, here we go. Yeah! But see, like, this game seems to understand something that so many other quote-unquote NES-like games try so hard to accomplish. And that is to actually be fun! This should be- this could be a frustrating fucking mess, to be fair here. But it's not, because the core controls are excellent, the gameplay's fantastic, the music's phenomenal, the visuals match exactly what I remember from my childhood and then some. And on a whole, there's nothing here keeping me from fucking finishing the level. I can run into one game-stopping fucking point where it's like, okay, I can't do this. It's too friggin' difficult, you know? Oh, shit. I had to open my mouth, didn't I? Ah, oh, shit, I was on it, too. Oh, 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 shovel knight! Away! Whew. Fuck off! Fucking ghostess with the mostest over here. Yeah. Oh, you son of a bitch! You... You... Oh, God, I've been destroying the save points. Oh, fuck. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's Shovel Knight. And... I'll tell you right now, this game kicks incredible major fucking ass. And this is, like, one of those games that I, I don't... Like highly, uh, I highly recommend some games, but this is gonna be one of the few times where I say that if you don't play this game, you're missing out on something really awesome. Now some people are gonna go, oh well, you know, it's just another retro game, another indie developer studio trying to one up it. Oh, it looks too much like an AI game. I don't want to pay ten bucks. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, all your excuses aside, if you actually like playing video games that are fun, challenging, and ultimately rewarding. I already feel rewarded for that other bit I talked about earlier. If you enjoy a rewarding and challenging game, and I've only played maybe, what, fucking half an hour of this grand total, but yeah, you want something fun to play that doesn't require an ass fuck ton of storyline and bullshit cutscenes and, like, next-gen visuals to actually have a good time, then, uh, yeah. Shovel Knight is the best goddamn game you can play right now, hands down. I give this my fucking seal of approval. Anyway, this has been Marco, and I've been playing Shovel Knight. Ciao, kitty vinkies.